know, it started with having thousands of girls come and audition, uh, and eventually just came down to one. Um, and and I think I think she was the right one of all of those thousands. So I suppose there's something kind of fairy tale like about the process of of coming down to to choosing her, and I hope that we've changed her life for the better as opposed to the worse. Oh, I, I really, I really, really wanted to play the role because, I mean, I'd, my mum had read the books to me and I'd seen the play at the National Theatre and I loved the character so much, I, you know, I wanted to be just... Um, the thing about Dakota is she has a great mum and, um, you know, she was, she's, she's very poised. I don't know if you've interviewed her yet, mm -hmm. but she, um, and it's why she got the role, I think, because Lyra is meant to have this intelligence and this seriousness and this kind of... Um, extraordinary will and willfulness and I think um, that you know Dakota has all of those things in abundance and so I, I I find it condescending if you start giving a kid advice and she's not a kid you know she's she's this young girl who who pretty much knows knows a lot about herself and I just stood back and let her do a thing <laughs> tried not to boss her around too much <laughs> I, I want to act like, but I don't want to do it as a full-time job. I want to, like, say if, a, if a, a film comes along that has, like, either a really good story or I really, really like the character, then, I mean, I'll do it. But I don't want to always be acting because I, I want to be a, su a supply teacher wow. in um, <laughs> primary. Dakota is a very strong child, very intelligent. You know, and she had school breaks during the day and she came back, you know, all fresh and focused all the time. And she's, um, I mean, she knows what she has to do. I don't have, I didn't have to give her any advice. You know, she's a strong little actress. It's a big part, big movie. And she's uh, very confident in a nice way. And um, I think she's captivating. Oh, yeah. I'm, I'm hoping. I mean, a lot of times as an actor, if you sign on for a film, you don't want to do a sequel. You think, oh, gosh, please, no. But for me, when you read the books, they get better. And so particularly for my character, she gets to evolve and these layers get peeled away and it's just a magnificent role. So I'm, I'm really hoping. Um, well, I mean, obviously it changes all the time. But um, I think my favourites are either a ring-tailed lemur a white hair, or a hedgehog. And why? Or why? Um, <laughs> I don't know. I, I just I see kind of parts of myself in them. Like I don't know. A hedgehog. I can be very defensive mm -hmm. when I want to be. Um, and and um, the white hair, just because you know it's quite bouncy, mm -hmm. and like. Um, active and stuff, and then the same kind of thing for ring-tailed lemurs. Um, but also with the ring-tailed lemur, when they're lazy and tired, they're really, really, really like just lazy and they just lie about. Yeah, <laughs>